What if I told you the Galaxy S25 FE could secretly be packing a chipset no one expected and it might actually be faster than Samsung's own? Sounds crazy, right? Well, that's exactly the kind of twist that's shaking up the Fan Edition lineup, and we're just getting started. Welcome back, viewers. James here. Don't forget to like, share this video, and hit that subscribe button if you love getting tech updates before everyone else. So here's the tea. The Galaxy S25 FE is not just another mid-cycle refresh. It's shaping up to be one of Samsung's most unpredictable releases yet. While most of us thought the Exynos 2400e was locked in as the brain behind this phone, a surprise contender is making a comeback. MediaTek's Dimensity 9400. Yep, the same chip that had quietly disappeared from the rumor mill months ago is suddenly back in the race. Why the plot twist? Samsung's foundries are apparently struggling to keep up with demand. Not only is the Exynos 2400e needed for the S25 FE, but Samsung is also planning to use it in the upcoming Galaxy Z Flip FE. Too many devices, not enough chips. So now the Dimensity 9400 is being eyed as a powerful plan B. And get this, it might even outperform the Exynos. That's right, the backup might actually be the upgrade. Now imagine this, Samsung doesn't just settle for what's available, they strategically pivot. If the foundries can't deliver on time, the company may switch to MediaTek, ensuring no delays and potentially giving us an even snappier device. This kind of backup plan isn't just smart, it's a rare peek into how cutthroat and fast-moving the smartphone world really is. And here's where it gets juicier. Firmware development for the Galaxy S25 FE has already kicked off. That means software, UI, Android 16, all being fine-tuned under the hood. The build number SMS731U is already out there, which is usually Samsung's way of saying, we're closer than you think. Could this phone be ready by the end of the year, or will they push it to early 2026? Either way, the clock's ticking. And guess what's expected out of the box? One UI 8 with Android 16 plus seven years of OS updates. That's longer than most relationships these days. Samsung's aiming to give pixel level longevity while keeping that FE price tag low. Speaking of the FE lineup, it's come a long way since the S20 FE. We've had the S21 FE, the S23 FE, and now the S24 FE. The S22 FE, ghosted. But now Samsung's fully back in the game, and the S25 FE might just be the most refined one yet. Leaks suggest the S25 FE will come in two RAM variants, 8GB and 12GB, and it could start at 256GB storage. That's a solid jump over the usual 128 GB you find in this segment. Oh, and camera lovers, don't worry, we're looking at a 50 MP main shooter, 12 MP ultra wide, and an 8 MP telephoto, with a possible new 12 MP selfie cam up front. Clean, crisp, and ready for TikTok. The battery, rumors say it'll be slimmer, wider, and possibly better at heat management. Charging might still cap at 25W, but whispers of a 45W upgrade are floating around. Wireless charging stays at 15W, which is decent for an FE model. Other expected goodies, stereo speakers, IP67 water and dust resistance, and the classic under-display fingerprint scanner. Basically, Samsung's not trying to reinvent the wheel here. They're polishing it. Now the big question, will we get Snapdragon variants in the US? Probably not. That might sting for Snapdragon fans, but Samsung's sticking to its strategy of mixing high-efficiency chips with long-term software support all to keep that price competitive. Bottom line, the Galaxy S25 FE is turning into a fascinating puzzle. Between chipset drama, software teasers, and Samsung's juggling act with multiple FE models, this phone could either be a sleeper hit or a surprise disruptor. And the wildest part, we still don't know what chip it'll actually ship with. Exynos or Dimensity. Either way, Samsung's playing it smart, and we're here for it. So if you love following tech with unexpected twists and insider scoops, Stick around, this ride's far from over.